So I'm gonna tell you guys, last night I was watching some TV and I ended up watching the New Jersey Housewives. There was this character, her name's Kim G. She's a total biatch. I realized that we had a mutual friend, so I gave her a call and she's actually sending her driver to pick me up. She's gonna send her driver in a Bentley to come pick me up and show me her house. I hear it's pretty sweet. So I'm gonna check out her house, drive her Ferrari, hang out with her and see if she's really an evil winch that everyone portrays her as. Oh my God, the car is here. I'll talk to you guys later. So Gene, have you been to her house before? Very, very nice house. Very nice house. I appreciate you coming and picking me up today. Is that her house up there? Yes, we're coming to her house now. So is this where I get out, sir? Uh, I'll get the door for you. Wow, I, I, I feel like a king. Gene, why well, thank you, sir. Wow, thank you. Wow. I wonder what this woman does. This house is amazing. Let's we'll see if there's gonna be a butler coming to the door. Oh, good evening, look who it is. Hello. 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 Yeah, yeah. Oh, I love Look. this! My parents used to have these. My friend Howard got these for me. I love them. I think they fit this house. It's, you know, it's kind of grand door. What room is this? This is my dining room. My kind of hangout, like, twice a year. Wow, <laughs> so is this where you do the Christmas? Yeah. Yeah. That chandelier was actually um, built by a gentleman in Massachusetts, and he came down here. It took him two days to assemble it. Can I move in? So you actually built this house? I built it. I built it. I built it. I was the uh, designer slash general contractor. I built it in mind so that you know, it would be cozy and you know comforting and war you know welcoming. Um, this town is very, very expensive. Right? What town are we in? Franklin Lakes. The focal point of my house, believe it or not, was my kitchen because I knew that everybody was going to congregate in there and everybody was going to hang so out. So like a typical Italian family, right? Yes, basically. I want to go see your kitchen. Let's, okay. let's go see your kitchen. You have an amazing kitchen. It looks like you had a little tea party here earlier. But you know what? This is real, so I'm not going to clean up for you just because you came here because who cares about you anyway? And, uh... <laughs> You're not going to clean up for me? I'm getting the hell out of here. You're not going to shoot me, are you? Yes. Cut. Oh my God. Okay, what do you want? I'll give you whatever you want. I don't think you have much, actually. That's, That's to protect question. your home. Absolutely. Single mom, hanging out with kids. You yeah. know, if someone comes yeah. in, you're going to shoot them. Oh, is that your security cam? Yes, and she's watching me from there. This is my workout room. Wow, great. I guess we're getting ready for what? Oh, uh, fashion week's coming up. Oh my God. Oh. I'm not going to help you. So this is the guest bed. Oh. This is the guest. Do you love it? I do. This is actually really comfortable. Would you serve me breakfast in bed? Absolutely. Like it would breakfast at Tiffany's, but yes. breakfast at Kimmy's. Absolutely. This is what my closet looks like. It's a big walk-in closet, and I have yeah. all my all my black suits are here. Okay. I'm only kidding. I wish, and then I woke up. Do you know what I do when I'm stressed out at home? I run hot water, glass of wine, and music. Come in the tub with me. Okay. This is like a little city. You live in a city, a castle. Tell me about your car. I thought I saw a Ferrari when I pulled up. I would love to drive your Ferrari. Did you look at license plate? I think it said slut. Oh my God, check this out. If we move that you around, she is a slut. I'm gonna drive that car and I hope I don't wreck, but the adrenaline's gonna be pumping through my body. What is <laughs> that? What the hell are you doing? That's loud, wow! Ah! <laughs> that was the fastest I've ever gone in my entire life. Look, no hands! If I had a fast car, I would probably kill myself. My heart's pounding. So's mine. My <laughs> you, gave the, you gave the slut a ride for her life. <laughs> my gosh. This was the sweetest day ever. I drove the fastest car I've ever driven in my entire life. This house is absolutely amazing to die for. I want to call it a castle. She was a little bit of a bitch, but that was all good though. I think it was more like an act, but I'll tell you, that car was a memorable experience and I'll never forget that. This episode's done and I'll see you guys on the next episode.